both Speaker Weatherford and President, Senate President Don Gates are focused in on ethics as a major part of their priorities. Um, what are they seeking and will they succeed? Well, here we have a Republican-led legislature that is um, just watched as the state has gone uh, Democratic again for the president. Um, they were able to, in, to elect a lot of Republicans. They kept the majority. They lost some seats to Democrats in both houses. Um, but they see that their, their reputation and, leg and I think public officials in general are not trusted by the public. So I think having an ethics bill come out as the first thing out of the gate is an effort to restore some trust. And, um, and they've also identified that there, there are maybe grand juries awaiting to happen when it comes to the use of some of the campaign finance money that a lot of legislators have used. And that has to do with these committees of uh, continuing ex existence that have morphed from being um, a membership-based kind of uh, political committee to one that, that individual lawmakers have used as kind of their political slush funds. And they've been able to spend it not on uh, electing themselves, but instead on paying for travel, entertainment. You know, there's stories about members who used it to even pay their mortgage. You know, it's just stories, but there's, they want to reverse that. So they're ending these, the CCEs as we know it. We're not quite sure which form it's going to end up taking. Um, but that, that's an attempt to kind of staunch the, the black eye that they see could happen and, and kind of their bad reputation.